empowered by the sine function serves a simple yet valuable purpose determining the mathematical sign of a number it returns 1 if the number is positive 0 if the number is 0 and minus 1 if the number is negative here's a breakdown of how it works function syntax sine number number any real number a column containing numbers or an expression that evaluates to a number example usage 1 check if a sales value is positive if sign sales equals 1 profit loss 2 filter transactions based on their sign transactions amount less than sign minus 100 3 create a calculated column indicating if a value is above or below 0 sign inventory average inventory asterisk change use cases categorization and filtering classify data points based on their positive negative or zero status conditional formatting apply different formatting rules based on the sign of a value calculations and comparisons perform calculations or comparisons that require identifying the sign of numbers data validation check if data entries conform to expected sign limitations advantages simplicity offers a clear and concise way to determine the mathematical sign of any number versatility applicable in various data analysis tasks across different data types and formats enhanced analysis enhances data understanding by facilitating categorization filtering and calculations based on the sign conclusion while seemingly basic, the sign function plays a valuable role in Power BI for manipulating and analyzing numerical data based on their mathematical sign. Remember to explore its potential and leverage it to gain deeper insights and enhance your data analysis tasks. Feel free to ask if you have any further questions about specific use cases, need help implementing it in your Power BI analysis, or have any other queries related to data analysis in Power BI.